Let's imagine you've got three samples, A, B and C. One is a primary, one is a secondary, and one is a tertiary alcohol. To find out which is which, we need to try and oxidize them all and then analyze the products formed. To start with, they would all be heated with acidified potassium dichromate, the oxidizing agent. The primary and secondary alcohols would be oxidized and therefore the dichromate ions present would be reduced and a colour change of orange to green would occur. The tertiary alcohol won't undergo oxidation at all, and this means that the solution will remain orange. The solution that remains orange at the end therefore must be the one that contains the tertiary alcohol. Now we need to distinguish between the primary and secondary alcohol. By heating the two solutions left, B and C, with acidified potassium dichromate and distilling the products, we ensure that the primary alcohol only goes to an aldehyde. This means one of the distillates now contains an aldehyde and the other a ketone. There are two tests we can use to confirm the presence of an aldehyde, Tollens reagent and phalene solution. Ketones don't give a positive result for either, only aldehydes. Now, whichever distillate from oxidation gives a positive result with either of these tests must be the aldehyde and therefore must have come from the primary alcohol, in this case, B. That